Hi, and welcome to an overview of Comdata's fuel management solutions. Come that as customer value proposition, we strive to be the driving force in payment innovation. Whether we're partnering with you to save money, grow your business, enhance operations, or minimize financial risk, we provide the insights and solutions that ensure your success. The value ComData brings to the table is in product innovation, people, and processes. When we speak directly about fuel management, we are dedicated to providing actionable information, and as a result, we've presented new products to our customers this year. Additionally, we've established a fuel management customer advisory board to ensure that we hear your voice and receive direction on the development of tools and services that continue to bring additional value to your business. Today, Comdata serves more than 25,000 clients through state-of-the-art technology and backup applications. When we discuss fuel management at Comdata, this is a service that we provide in a value add, so no additional cost to the, additional, to the original program cost that you've incurred. However, one of the things that you should always keep in mind when you're developing a fuel management program is to make sure that you have goals that improve driver productivity and meet organizational policies, as well as establishing and meeting regulatory compliance efforts. One of the things that we do here at Comdata is to help you develop a fuel management strategy. This fuel management strategy should have clear and size goals for your program. Determine the structure of your program, and what we mean by this is to understand how should you buy your fuel, whether that's through bulk, retail, or through mobile fuel applications. We work with you to partner to decide the organizational responsibilities, both on your side and our side. We'll establish who has ownership, for example, to educate cardholders on the discount programs you have in place or the policies associated to using their cards. We also want to make sure we're helping you to understand the applicable regulations. For example, if you choose to have bulk site tanks, what are the regulations associated with that? The fifth step of a strong strategy then is to understand and define driver accountability and the responsibilities that those drivers have. 99% of drivers out there want to do the right thing by the customer. But in order to have an effective program, you need to educate them on the benefits and how they can effectively help you through that process. Lastly, an effective strategy allows you to measure the results of your program, continually refining this. This is not a one-time event, but a continual process. So if you haven't taken a look at your process on an annual basis, a good piece of advice is to start doing so now. How can Comdata help? We have tools and services available either through your sales associate or directly through the Comdata fuel management team. We'll share with you ways to contact us directly in a moment. But I wanted to share with you some of the tools available as being a Comdata customer. The first one is SmartBuy. SmartBuy is a tool available to Comdata customers through iConnectData.com. This effective online tool allows you to see pricing, as we see here in Jessup, Maryland, allows you to see averages within a 10-mile radius for the type of fuel you've selected. It's a real-time environment showing prices as of yesterday. In this particular example, you can see there's a 40-cent swing in the price in just one 10-mile radius. After you see the map on the screen, you'll then see a text version. And this text version allows you to see the cheapest places to buy in a text environment relative to other locations and in descending order of retail price. It also gives you insight as to whether or not there's a discount being offered to Comdata customers. This tool will allow you to see how quickly, within just a one or two mile radius, you can effectively buy fuel cheaper. For example, if you look at the bottom of the page, you'll see 7894 Washington Boulevard. The price at that location was 3559 while just up the street at 7311 Washington Boulevard, you can see the Exxon's price is 10 cents cheaper at 345. You continue on down Washington Boulevard, just across the street at 7300 Washington, you can see the price is 335. So 
So basically within a one or two block radius, you can see the price changes in t within 20 cents per gallon. This is an effective way to completely reduce your fuel cost just by understanding pricing within a geographic area. Another tool that we use in our fuel management area are fuel studies. Fuel studies allow us to help you understand what you're doing today, where you're buying fuel, and then allows us to understand and set goals. This particular example that we're looking at on the screen looks at a piece of pie of fuel power in 2010 by a specific fleet. Based on the discounts that they have in place, their pie should look more like the one on the right where the 2011 low cost gallons are shown. By further consolidating their gallons, they also then qualify for greater discounts. So fuel studies are a common way that we work with fleets to help them understand their buying power. Next, we have fuel benchmarking tools. This particular tool that we're showing you on the screen right now is for one of our proprietary over-the-road accounts. And it shows a gallon range at the bottom of your page. Also allows you to see a particular sample fleet here in red that's buying at 311 while others within that same segment are buying at 308. On the surface, that may look bad. However, the next challenge is to understand what's going on. For example, if that particular fleet is buying all of their fuel in California, then of course they're going to be higher than their average. However, if that same fleet is buying their fuel in the Gulf Coast states, their numbers should be lower. So then we have to peel back the onion and look at purchase power by state, by pad, and other elements to understand whether or not this fleet is buying poorly or acceptable. Another new tool is the low cost fuel index. And there's two different versions of this. These are now available at comdata.com. The first version is a by state, by interstate. And you can see as the example we have on the screen, in the state of Tennessee, we have three major interstates. I-40 that runs east-west, 24 that also runs east-west, and I-65 running north and south. In this example, we would show you the three cheapest places to buy fuel along Interstate 40, along I-24, and along Interstate 65. We have on the low cost index every single state with every interstate and the three cheapest places along those areas. The other version allows you to see a geographic area and a 100 mile radius within that geographic area of the three cheapest places to buy. Again, this tool is available at comdata.com. It's updated monthly. We encourage you to go take a look at that. The last tool that we have are price protection plans and our partnership with other companies in bringing these plans to you. These are very popular right now, especially as the price of fuel continues to rise. The bottom line on a price protection plan are they are not traditional hedging programs. So as a result, you don't have a lot of the basic requirements related to traditional hedging. For example, one of the key benefits of this program or programs like this is that any fleet can participate, whether you have 200 gallons a month or 20,000 or 2 million gallons a month. makes no difference. Anyone can partic participate. Secondly, it doesn't matter whether you're buying diesel or gasoline. You can participate. The other benefit that you'll derive from this is if the price goes below a certain level, you're not stuck in a long-term contract that prevents you from taking advantage of a low-cost option. So price protection plans are very popular right now. And we encourage you to ask your sales associate for more information. As with any of these tools that we've discussed, you can contact us for more information directly with Comdata's Fuel Management Department at fuelmanagementdept at comdata.com. You can contact your sales associate or your customer service representative for more information. Thank you.